deploy your uh, songs from their respective movies? Especially um, in Sure. Kasi yun na yung number namin actually. Kasi nga, yung mga movies na napapanood ko before sa sinihan ha, yun talaga kung dun ko siya talaga inidolo eh. Yung mga bitungin mo lang yung name. I think it's okay with her, no? Yun naman yata talaga yung gagawin namin. So syempre, tribute na rin. Tribute to her. So, yun. Thank you. How many songs do you expect to be from Sharon? Hmm. Ilan ang duet mo? Siguro we'll have one medley. We'll do one medley together. Opo. Pero madaming kanta naman yan kasi it's a medley. Ganon din with Piola and Big DJ. Yeah. But with Piola, I think we're just singing yung duet namin before, which is parang kay... Thank you. This is actually quite huge. Can you first tell us how did this all come about and the the actual theme for it? How did it start? Um, like I said, I did this kind of concept some ten years ago. For the music. Oh, huh? For the theater. No, this, this, yung at the movies, ginawa ko na to some 10 years ago. And after kasi uh, R3.0, we wanted to do a smaller show, pero yun na nga, gusto namin may concept. And every year, di ba, iba-iba naman yung concept, like some, and then, four years ago by at the theater, parang ganun. Mga uh, three years ago, di, four? Sa Soler. Sa Soler, mga four years na yun. Para three. O, oh, di kahapon lang. <laughs> <laughs> Para, so, pagka maliliit na shows, talagang mas maganda na may concept. Para, wala, gusto namin yun. Parang yun yung chance namin to do these kinds of shows. Kaya naisip namin to do at the movies again. Kasi ang dami na ulit mga bagong songs. dami ng mga movies na dumating na hindi ko pa nakanta nung some 10 years ago, obviously. That's why we wanted to do it again. Will it be like more of like a Barbara Streisand symptom thing? Or... or uh, yung, yung concept ko ng concert ko, magiging Barbara Streisand type mo siya na super small group of people that and then you're gonna sit down and like talk and you say um, well, our, our venue is uh, uh, New Frontier, which was, which was, uh, it was used to be a movie house before. In the 80s ba yan? 80s hanggang 90s? Yeah, yes. Oo, so perfect talaga yung place eh. Uh, kasi dati siyang sinihan, so tamang-tama na doon namin din gagawin yung at the movies. Uh, as far as... The setting is much smaller if you compare it, let's say, kung ginawa namin sa Araneta, parang mas mahirap siya gawin pang Araneta kasi hindi naman pang Araneta yung mga, at least I think, you know. So, ginawa namin on a smaller scale kasi hindi ko rin alam bakit, pero parang mas madali kasing gumawa ng conceptualized na concert if it's a, if it's a smaller Um, there'll be some fast songs. There'll be some fast songs. I will, of course, once again dance my heart away. As you all know, I'm the best dancer in the universe, of course. And I don't, I don't want to give away too much of the show, is it? But um, it will be exciting kasi marami sa mga kanta na to, hindi ko pa nakakanta. Yung iba, alam ko na, pero not necessarily ko na na-perform. So, ayan. Alright, um, about transferring to ABS-CBN, um, have you already mentioned, like, I, I mean, have you already felt like, I'm so glad to have transferred to ABS because I got the same with this early artist? Um... Like I said, I'm excited because I am going to be able to do that. I'm going to sing. You know, I 
it was so surreal for me when I was in Australia singing with Gary Valenciano and and Sila Eric and Angeline. I mean, I would sing with them on stage, on a performance on stage. So, sunay naman ako dun, but seeing it on TV, parang, oo nga pala, ginawa pala namin yun sa, para sa ASAP. It was an ASAP concert, it was an ASAP show. So, parang, oo nga, no? I forgot. So, medyo naninibago ako seeing myself on TV. Pero, I'm getting there. I just have to get used to the idea. Um, at the same time, like I said, kaya excited pa rin. Hindi nga nawawala yung excitement ko kasi thinking of all the possibilities I can, you know, I can do. Yung mga concerts na naiisip ko na pwede kong gawin with, you know, with Gary, hopefully, someday with Sharon, with Sarah, with Alam mo yun, ang dami eh, ang daming possibilities talaga. So, kaya excited na excited ako. More than anything else. But none of them actually like stand out, just in general. Your, I mean, your, your, you're quite okay with like, um, having a moment you know? Not, not in particular like a single artist. Do you have like a single artist in mind that you that, said that I'm glad to have you people to work with? To work with? Um, actually, alam mo, I'm, since I'm doing a sitcom, I'm excited to work with my husband again. Kasi, although kasama ko naman siya everyday sa bahay, <laughs> pero parang iba rin yun to work with, you know, with your husband, iba rin. Um, I'm excited about that. Siyempre, yung mga singers, excited ako to work with them. Parang, like I said, the possibilities that we can do. Pero excited ako din to work with my husband. Um, More than anybody else. Oo, ayun ko. Kasi siguro kasi iba rin yung nakakatrabaho ko siya. At saka this time kasi, sitcom. So, alam mo yung alam na alam niya na gawin yun. Ako hindi pa, pero since kasama ko siya, okay lang. So, excited ako. Have you already taped like several episodes for it? Not yet, but I think we're going to a room. Okay, congratulations. Thank you very much. At saka si, ano, si Ian Veneracion. Yan pa lang ang confirm. Yan pa lang ang confirm, pero parang madami pa. Marami pa nga daw, sabi ni Pong, hindi kaso nakalimutan niya, hindi rin niya masyara na pakinggan. Maganda rin. Alam mo yung asawa ko kung makakalimot na nakakatawa. Pero so far yun pa lang yung sinabi sa akin. Pero madami pa eh. Madami pa ang asawa. Did you do yung reference to ako? The same song? Yes. Sorry, nights sila. Kaya hindi nila alam. Birthday nights, iba-iba yung rep. So Bali, I'm learning something like 50 songs. Kaya, pag pumili ka sa amin ng ticket sa November 17, iba ang mapapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapagpapag
I, I, I love it talaga. So, napakalaki ng, ng influensya ng pelikula sa akin. Kaya na idol ko si Shaw. Super idol ko. Sorry, late din ako. Pero tanong ko lang din po with the free um, installment. Tanong ko lang din po yung concept behind that. And then, dun ba yun? Kasi different target audience niya sa different production. Well, it, it has also become kasi my reputation. Every time I have a second night or a third night. <laughs> Ewan ko ba? Bakit iniiba namin yung yung rec, but uh, it started kasi na because kailan ba natin ito yung bisan yung iba iba yung rec? Ating musika, which was 10 years ago, it was all OPM songs and we had like 10 nights. No? So, Friday, Saturday yun eh. So, iba yung rec ng Friday, iba yung rec ng Saturday. Only because we couldn't choose which songs to put in. Kasi ang daming magagandang OPM songs. So ever since then, nung ginawa din namin yung R30, yung like second night, iba rin yung rep. So parang naging, <laughs> lagi na namin ginagawa. So, eh, since we're gonna do three nights, people were asking if we're going to do different rep for different nights. So, na-decide namin, iba na atin. So, it's uh, different repert uh, repertoire every night. Para mag-appeal ito, different play crowds, mas mm -hmm. mayroon. Oh. And then, last na lang po, um, yung stage director niya is Paolo Valentino. Yes, this is my third time to work with him. So, um, yung process po, would you sing him is because you're familiar with him? Or meron kayong style na gusto with this time around? Um, because he's good, period. Yun lang yun. At saka, siyempre, importante rin daw na mabanggit ang musical director. Ah, napakagaling. Ay, sila lang kilala ni Kakay. Ay, super. Best friend sila. Oh, nandito kanina eh. Yes, no? from all nature, of course, from musical director. Hindi yung ambition ng bosses mo para parang recharge ka ba? Or parang ba? Slowly, slowly, nagpo-voice lessons ako. Slowly, slowly, it's getting there. Oo, oh, kailangan eh. Um, it's because I don't really use it. I I hardly use it. Uh, once a year lang naman ako nagko-concert. <laughs> Tapos, ina-expect ko na pagka nag-concert ako, nandun siya lahat. Siyempre, hindi, di ba? Mga nanay talaga siya. I need to use it. I have to keep singing. And that's what I've been telling myself. I have to. Para ngayon, sa bahay ngayon, kanta ako ng kanta. I'm trying my best to, ano, para, it's not gonna be easy. Uh, kasi nga, like I said, kasama ng boses ko, pati yung sarili ko, nanganay kami pa rin. So, in 2019, hmm. we're expecting more shows and concerts since marami na pang pwedeng makakasama from PBS? Oo, oh, alam niyo naman na ang da mahilig akong mag-collaborate, di ba? So next year, ang dami kong mga collaborations na pwedeng gawin up till 2019, no? O 2020. Hanggang 2020. And who knows kung gano'n pa katagal. Ang dami kasi talaga. Kasi nandun lahat yung mga singers na gusto kong makakollaborate na I haven't, you know, been able to work with. So, it's very exciting. Sisingit ka ba dito na review the review chain? Sa, sa, sa concert? Kahit wala sa concert? Hindi ko alam. Parang, baka hindi siguro. Pero baka sa, sa ibang paraan magawa namin yan. Sa ibang paraan. Pero nakakalungkot, ano? Hindi, pati si, ano, bayani at saka si, ano? Bigla lang, ano? Si Bong, di ba parang nakita pa natin siya? When was the last time I saw him? Si ano, si Bayani at si Bong. Parang nakakita ko lang eh. Si Bayani, hindi na hospital. Ha? Hindi siya na hospital. No. Hindi, di ba nga dapat daw meron pa siyang flight? Yes. So,